we were going through sod cutter after sod cutter after sod cutter. Finally, I felt that I felt comfortable with the Bluebirds. And then we ran the Bluebirds for years. They're a pretty solid unit, but they're not hydros. So there was chains and belts that this machine does not have that were always an issue. I'll tell you what, this is not a cheap sod cutter, but contractors, I'm here to tell you, this thing's built like a tank. Everything is quarter inch steel. I mean, it's just truly built like a tank. That weight helps you when you set it for a really deep, deep cut to get that two and a half inches. And guys, we've been running this thing hard for two seasons now. I mean, really, really hard. Like, showing it no love kind of hard. And has yet, has yet to have anything fail. So, my review on this Billy Goat sod cutter, this Hydro, and there's only a couple on the market. So, there's not a lot to choose from. But, you know, you know what they say by about hydraulics and hydros. I mean, it's liquid steel. You know, this stuff is uh, is less likely, less likely to break. So, three decades of dealing with Ryan's and all these others that I now hate and can't stand. And the Bluebird, like I said, was kind of the one that we settled on for last, you know, 20 years prior to getting this Billy Goat. But I will recommend this Billy Goat over and over and have and have it's worth the investment yeah and the price tag's a bit steep guys i'm just gonna tell you you're looking at about five grand here so for a sod cutter but it'll be the last sod cutter you ever buy and when you can send it out and know that it's not going to break so here's a testimonial from the french drain man this thing's built solid and and you're going to spend more time pounding jobs in the ground and moving forward instead of sitting there broken down. All right, guys, until the next video.